Hi there, Pisces. It's Abby. Welcome to your reading. Uh, this is going to be for any Pisces, any placement, any Pisces cross watcher. If you feel like it resonates with you, then go ahead and claim it. If it doesn't, then feel free to check out another one of my timeless readings and see if uh, what you're looking for is in there, okay? So I decided I just want to do a few like little minis. Um, I'm going to start up the Oracle readings again. Um, so I'm also going to shoot a few that we bring out those beautiful Oracle cards and look at those. But I just wanted to do like little three card spreads. So let's see what's going on here. I'm going to ask for what the Pisces who might be watching this might need to see or hear. Okay, Pisces. Okay, so this reading is for someone who is dealing with a relationship, a union, a situationship, whatever it is, it has to do with some kind of um, mix of energies of two people, two beings, people coming together, okay? Um, and there's a really deep and intimate kind of soul recognition, I would say, where there's like a funny sameness with this person, they sort of fill in all the spots or they're like the opposite. We have a lot of like images of polarity here. So this feels like, like say if they have a temper, you're more calm. Or if, you know, if you tend to rush, they like to slow things down. Um, and they have that kind of effect and you kind of light a fire under them and, or they like inspire you to, to, you know, stop and smell the roses, that kind of thing. There's this very complimentary, beautiful kind of energy to that, okay? And place yourself in that however that resonates. The challenge that's showing up in this has a lot to do with someone trying to find their direction and trying to heal and have hope in for whatever it is that they want. There's, I'm getting a sense of a little bit of insecurity and I feel like that might be linked to especially trying to bring this into the public eye uh, there's someone that feels like they aren't worthy of the attention that this sort of union um, could possibly be bringing to them there's some kind of um, like recognition that they don't feel comfortable with and I'm not sure if it's you or them, could be either way, right? Take it however it resonates. But there is like, while there's a lot of hopes and dreams attached to it, there's this very uh, lost feeling because it's like they wish they knew what to do or that they felt comfortable doing it, like just putting things out there, saying what they need to say because this is a part of their journey. This is a part of a test and it's a part of healing for whoever that this is affecting the most and who's ever kind of dealing, digging their heels in a little bit or being like reluctant almost in the way that they're dealing with this, um, this union, okay? The suggestion that the cards are giving is the emperor. So this is telling you Pisces that the thing to do at this point in time is to take your power back. Um, to take control, to know that you have all of the skills and abilities to be able to command what you need in this. Um, there might be a temptation for you to make an ultimatum, all right? Um, and I feel like the cards are cautioning against being too harsh with that, um, but to definitely put what you need out there, to say it very clearly, um, because I feel like there's a, a chance of sort of freezing things out because there is a bit of like fear and insecurity in this already, okay? But you definitely have everything that you need to put it out there, to say exactly what you need, what you feel. And it's not going to be from a controlling place, okay? It doesn't feel like that's what you're being suggested. It feels like it's more like find your grounded center where you can take action on this and say what needs to be said and everything will work out as it's supposed to. Um, I would say with the way that this hand is looking, how it's kind of turning to stone there, be cautious about trying to control too much, okay? The situation is going to go exactly where it wants to go. See, and there's six of wands. That's success. 
that's public recognition. I knew there was something that had to do with like the public sphere. Um, so if it feels like someone is scared to take things public, Facebook official, if you will, I don't know if that's you or them. Um, but if whether that's you telling them that you're expressing those insecurities to this person, um, and maybe they've been being like, come on, let's do it. <laughs> if you're the one who's stalling, tell them what you need. Um, if they're the one who's been stalling for whatever reason, then this is basically saying like, okay, like let them know, <laughs> let them know what you want and what you need. And um, that, you know, you have standards in the situation and that you're worth taking out into the light, right? Okay, Pisces, I hope that was helpful to you in some way. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. I hope to see you here again on the next one. Lots of love. Bye now.